the Taurus. This is going to be your end of December reading. Of course, whenever you are guided to watch this is the time that you need to hear the message. So what I was getting for you guys is the phrase taking a chance. So you could be taking a chance on someone or someone could be taking a chance on you. You could be done with the water sign. We have the king of cups and the five of cups. Somebody could feel regret when it comes to a water sign. Cancer Pisces a Scorpio, whether they feel regret or this is you. Okay. Three of Cups, Reconciliation. If you've just recently reconciled with a water sign, you can regret that decision. I'm also getting Five of Cups is just like sadness. Somebody could be sad. They could want to reconcile with you. Damn, yeah, we have the Queen of Cups. King and Queen of Cups, this is a soulmate here. Somebody could have let go of a soulmate wanting to reconcile. What is the energy surrounding Taurus? Okay, Thy Priestess, you can't be done with the Pisces. There's regret around this situation. It sounds like your intuition when your intuition could have told you something. Maybe somebody didn't follow their intuition. This could have been you or them. Do you have the devil card here? So I feel like this relationship, King and Queen of Cups, you guys definitely could have been together since there's a couple here. There could have been some unhealthy behavior around this connection. You could be done with the Capricorn as well. But I feel like this is just some unhealthy behavior surrounding this connection. This could be codependency, emotionally codependent financially codependent whatever it is <clears throat> we do have the tower here so i feel like there could be some communication that surprises you or something that happened that could surprise you also this could be a breakup that just happened all of a sudden um it's like pretty much you guys this whole foundation just got destroyed in a matter of seconds like it just feels very like boom type energy and then like you guys are apart we have the Nine of Pentacles here, so I do feel like somebody's single and doing better. Somebody can be better off single. We do have the Nine of Pentacles, so this is like you being very independent by yourself. Good. It's like you're better off single. We have the Seven of Wands here, so I feel like you could have blocked this person. This person could have blocked you on social media. I'm also getting protect yourself. You could be protecting yourself from... Just this whole energy, like a, the devil card, this is very, this relationship, there was something very unhealthy about it. We have the queen of wands here in reverse. Queen of wands in reverse is like an asshole, pretty much. So yeah, this is could be who you've been dealing with. It's a fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, it doesn't have to be a fire sign. I'm also getting jealousy. Somebody could have been very jealous. And that could have caused problems in the relationship as well. Clarify the king of cups. Okay, Page of Pentacles in the reverse. I feel like something wasn't working for you. You could have been very confused about what is going on in this situation. Or what was going on, or if it was going to move forward. The Seven of Cups is also options. Maybe you decided to pursue other options, or they did. Clarify the Five of Cups. Okay. Yeah, ooh. The Lover's card. So you could be done with the Gemini. But I'm feeling like... With... The lovers were like clarifying the five of cups. Somebody regrets a relationship. Somebody regrets a connection. Mm. Clarify the three of cups. Clarify the three of cups. Okay. Yeah, I just feel like somebody could have regret stayed, staying in the situation for so long. I'm also getting, if you want to reconcile with somebody else, or someone wants to reconcile with you, they could regret taking so long to say hey i want to reconcile or let's meet up or something they could regret taking so long clarify the queen of cups clarify the queen of cups okay will of fortune reverse Ooh, with the three of swords yeah things weren't working out with this pisces it doesn't have to be a pisces but things were working out with them I'm also getting time with this Knight of Pentacles. This is very slow energy. Somebody could have regretted all the times that they all the time that they put into this connection. Whether this is you or them. Clarify the high priestess. Okay, yeah. Temperance. Healing. I feel like you're healing from this whole situation. And I do feel like somebody is better off just being alone. Like the person is like, there's only one person on this horse. Like, someone is better off being alone. And I feel like your intuition could be telling you this. Clarify the devil. 
the devil could be codependency, addiction, um, anything like that. Somebody could have felt trapped in this connection as well. Or by the devil. Like, they didn't have a choice. Yeah, stress. Someone, someone was scared to move on. Like, they were very, very, very caught up in the situation. Almost feeling trapped in the situation. It was very difficult for either you to move on or them to move on. Right by the tower. It's almost like if you guys did move on, something made you. Something, like, literally made you guys have to move on. Or something separated you guys. I'm also getting, with this devil card, this person's stuck in a cage. Somebody could be in jail. Like, maybe someone went to jail and you guys were forced to go your separate ways. Like, just something crazy happened to where it's done. Like, the universe stepped in and ended the situation. But this could be happening in the future. Clarify the tower. And I feel like this happened because there was something about the relationship that was not allowing you guys to grow. Yeah, six of pentacles in the reverse. Not allowing you, pretty much blocking your blessings. So, we have the Two of Pentacles and the Knight of Cups. So, I'm feeling like this is being alone right now, being single right now, is really going to help you balance out your emotions. Also, feel that you do have other options in love as well. But there's like a need for balance in this situation, a need for healing in this situation. This could be something that you are working on currently. I feel like the other person could be having a really hard time moving on. Clarify the Queen of Wands in reverse. This is jealousy. The Queen of Wands in reverse is very jealous. And this can be paired with this devil here, like extreme jealousy. Clarify for the Queen of Wands in reverse. Ooh, yeah, the tower. I feel like you could have saw a situation for what it was. This could have shocked you. Maybe you were the one that ended it because you just all of a sudden are like, got clarity. Like, oh, like it's like this person took off their mask. But it's like the Queen of Cups, it's like, oh, she's the ideal partner. Yes, I want to be with her. And then she turns out to be the Queen of Wands in reverse, which is an absolute bitch. Like, in the reverse, no. That's that's not a good queen to have in the reverse. So, it's like, you realize this about them, the tower. You could be doing with Scorpio. Okay. What is the advice for Taurus? What is the advice? Okay, hold on. Damn. So the tower just showed itself to me again. It's almost saying as advice, allow the like it's almost like just see this as a blessing, this separation, this whatever. But we do have the hermit card here. This is as advice, this is really focusing on yourself, kind of isolating yourself and allowing yourself to heal from whatever situation you've gone through. Especially after this tower, it's like kind of just taking a moment. Whether it's a week, a month, or five minutes just to really be with yourself, listen to your own thoughts, listen to your intuition, and do what's best for you. So, anyway, I hope this was a good reading for you, Taurus. If you would like a personal, there's information down below on how you can get one and enjoy the rest of your month.